using Renzulli to differentiate. Okay, here's the problem. If you're like most teachers, you've got a classroom full of 20 or more students, and you've got a big long list of required standards you need to teach. Some of those kids are really interested in the subject material and like to learn in whole group instruction and express what they've learned in written form. Some of them are more interested in other things, hmm. and they won't get engaged in anything in which they're not interested. Some of them are totally disengaged and unprepared. Some of them would rather learn independently or in small groups, or through games or role-playing. Your principal is worried about classroom management. There's someone from the district office checking in to make sure you're staying on a quick pace. There are parents at the door who are concerned you're pushing their kids too hard, and there are parents who think you're not pushing their kids hard enough. You've only got three computers, and you don't have much time. And hovering over all of this is the ghostly specter of those educational pioneers you found so inspiring back when you were getting your teaching license. Those teachers and researchers who had you so convinced that you could be the inspiring, creative, engaging teacher you know that all your students deserve. And you're working so hard to be that teacher. Well, that's why we made Renzulli. Renzulli is not another thing on your plate. Renzulli is a tool designed by educators, maybe some of the same ones you read about back in the day, to help you with all that stuff on your plate. Let's start at the beginning. Renzulli defines differentiation as matching the required content, those glorious state standards, with each individual student's interests, learning styles, abilities, and product styles. So as you might imagine, you can't even begin to differentiate if you don't know your students' interests learning styles, abilities, and product styles. It's like trying to find your way without a map. Well, Renzulli finds out how your students learn, how they best express what they know, what they're interested in, and what their strengths are. So now you get your map. So now you know whether that lesson plan you're going to try next week will work before you give it. You can run reports and instantly find out what strategies will work best for your class. Renzulli will even tell you how to group your students by learning styles so the independent workers can do their thing, the technology kids can squeeze out a little more screen time, and the lecture listeners can come to the front. And Renzulli will even find online resources to match each student's interests. So let's say you have to teach a unit on gravitational pull, Boring. and you've got students who are interested in athletics, social action, and performing arts, but who don't find gravitational pull all that attractive. Well, all you need to do is tell Renzulli you want them to learn about gravity, and Renzulli will find resources that bridge the content with the motivation. So your students can get engaged with baseball science to learn how gravity affects a thrown ball. Cool. Build your own aquifier to learn how gravity applies to real-world social problems, wow. and create a dance routine to learn how gravity plays a role in choreography. Oh. So your students are getting content that's interesting, presented in a way that's appealing. So you can still keep on pace with your standards nice. and run an impressively well-managed class, mm. as well as showing those parents how you're challenging and engaging their children at just the right level. Yay. And you're doing it. You're bringing creativity and joy back to learning, you're managing that to-do list, and you're boosting your students' test scores. And that's the power of differentiation made easy. That's the power of Renzulli. Bye. Do, 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 do.